been wrestling since I was about seven or eight years old. I started out, I used to watch WWE a lot when I was a little kid, and I had a bunch of like life-size stuffed animals, you know, like the ones you get from the fair. And I would wrestle with them in the living room and stuff, and finally, you know, my dad bugged my mom, and he's like, we need to put him in wrestling, we need to put him in wrestling. And so, you know, at a young age, they took me to wrestling practice, and I loved it. So I'm a specialist in Duffield. I am a soldier athlete here at the World Class Athlete Program, and I'm also a 12 November for the 3120th Engineering Company. So the World Class Athlete Program is a, a tool that the Army uses to help soldiers reach like their you know world and Olympic goals, you know, in athletics. You know, there's kind of two sides to the book. You got your, your military side and your athleticism side, um, but being part of the World Class Athlete Program kind of bridges that, right? Like they give you know big opportunities that most people don't get as to serve your country and be in the military, you know, and have your military duties done. And also, you know, compete in my sport and, you know, continue to try to reach my Olympic goals. I'm a six-time U.S. national team member. Um, I got fifth at the ranking tournament in Zagreb, Croatia this year. Now I feel like I'm doing it, you know, and I'm gaining all these accolades, but I'm also, like, you know, helping something bigger than myself, you know, I'm working towards something that's not just for me personally. I mean, I feel like we really, you know, push towards the be all you can be motto for the Army and, you know, really show like resiliency in a lot of the things we do because, you know, wrestling's hard, you know, what we do is hard being an athlete and, you know, fulfilling our military duties at the same time, it gets pretty difficult. The Army has so much more to offer and you have so much more to offer the Army than you could ever even think. You know, I would say to, to do your research and figure out what you really want to do and anything that you could possibly want to do, you know, throughout the world, the Army offers in some way, shape or form.